Hi, my name is Dr. Dan Johnson. I'm the superintendent of the Butler School District. A makerspace is a place in our school that will allow us to have our students go in, learn science, technology, engineering, art, and math in combination. Uh, through that, they're going to be able to do creative problem solving. They're going to learn coding. They're going to be able to work collaboratively on authentic problem solving uh, capabilities. What we're going to use it for, uh, particularly at our K-4 level, is it's going to become part of our whole school enrichment model. So every student will be able to cycle through the makerspace. They'll be able to get enrichment uh, activities and be able to learn the foundation of coding that then will be followed up with them as they continue in their academic careers. A lot of research has been done in regards to how students learn. Uh, physiologically, it's been shown that because of uh, the gamification that they go through and the different things that they go through at an early age, their brain synapses actually fire differently and they're used to different ways of thinking. And we need to be able to create spaces that build off of that strength that they have at a young age uh, and allow them the opportunity to continue to evolve in a world that coding is going to be one of the biggest things that they're going to have to do for any job. So we wanted to start the foundation young get them ready to be successful as they move up uh, throughout our school district, and then give them opportunities leaving high school, uh, whereas if they're not necessarily going to college but they want to pursue a career, we're giving them the foundation for that. So the makerspace at Aaron Decker School is going to be located uh, where our current computer lab is. We're going to disassemble uh, what was the traditional computer lab uh, that had rows of desktops, and we're going to use alternative furniture. We're going to put Chromebooks in there. Uh, and we're going to continue to utilize uh, video projection and make it more of an inviting space. And from there, we're hoping to establish it next year and then put one at our middle school the following year, uh, following that same pattern of taking an old computer lab and turning it into more of a 21st century learning space. Wendy Gorecki is our STEAM teacher at the elementary school. Uh, she was our technology teacher, and as soon as I came into the district, her and I really created a good partnership and started to talk about what we could do at that level. And she helped uh, and was instrumental in the writing of this grant. Um, she really has been kind of the lead in this. And then going forward, as we create the space, she's going to be the one that is going to help write the curricula over the summer with me. Uh, we are going to then make sure we can put it into the district next year as part of the cycle classes. Um, none of this would really be able to happen without her leadership and, and her abilities. The BBA was uh, integral in bringing this to the Butler School District. Uh, fortunately, when I was hired at the end of last year, one of the first groups I met was the BBA, and they were just really kind of getting their foundation set in regards to where they wanted to go and how they wanted to help the school district. And we started tossing ideas around about where we wanted to be and how we were going to do it. Um, and the individuals, the trustees on the board of the BBEA, uh, they are committed to the Butler School District. They are all people who have a deep foundation and roots here in the district. And they want to give us opportunities that budgetarily we don't necessarily have. Uh, the $24,000 that they're able to grant to us for this makerspace was something that could not be included in our budget. Uh, however, because they were able to give that to us, we are now able to build something for kids that's going to set them up for success in the future. I truly believe that this generation of students has the capability to be the next greatest generation. They are doing things that we couldn't have thought of doing. They're creating their own positions. They're managing networks of thousands of colleagues and, and peers and friends. And we have to give them the opportunities to learn how to take all of the knowledge that's there in our world at their fingertips that we didn't have growing up and use that to create new knowledge. To me, being able to partner with the BBEA create a makerspace that is tailored to our own district, find all the pieces that we need, be able to customize it to who we are as a district is invaluable. Uh, we're going to create something that I believe that no other school district will be able to have uh, in the state. 